Hi everyone, is it Vlogmas number 21 or is it my Ipsy glam bag? Yes. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back. Can you believe Vlogmas 21, four days to Christmas? I don't know if I'm going to get through this or not. I'm just so excited. And I don't know if I'm more excited because I've still got some costumes, some ugly sweaters that I can wear that I haven't gone through them all. Or am I excited because on Christmas Day I get to open up the countdown to New Year's with the sparkling wine, the champagne ones. Who knows why, but I'm excited to be here with you guys. So thank you so much for taking time out of your day to spend with me. I know it's such a crazy, crazy busy time of year, and I appreciate you guys more than you know. So let's try to move on so I don't take up too much of your time. Okay, so first, nutcracker of the day. This is one that I got from Bombay Company, the, the outlet that used to be like five minutes away. I miss that store. I mean, they were... Pr good prices throughout the year because it was an outlet but after Christmas they used to have some incredible incredible sales some really like one-of-a-kind items that I used to love um, my mom used to love to get wacky crazy things nobody else would would buy for it she loved to get things like that and it was just just a fun fun place to shop so anyway this is one of the larger nutcrackers well not the largest in the country but one of the largest I have so again, he's from Bombay Company. We got like this kind of gold shiny stand pedestal that he's on. We've got some gold sparklies and some berries on the stand. The bottom is like the velvet or the felt. So if you put it on a desk and move it, it's not going to scratch it. He's got some nice red tassels on his boots. The red and black stripes with some gold on his uh, pants and we've got gold details we got a present with some nice bows he's got some jewelry here with some chains some really nice curly hair his wig hair even on this the cuffs he's got the the detail and his sword and he's got a nice red cape and even you know in the back it is a nutcracker he's got a nice crown right here and he's just a really fun little nutcracker. And I know that he didn't cost that much because, yeah, I would have got it at the Bombay outlet and after Christmas sales. Man, if I miss that store, I wish they would come back. Alrighty, so that's my nutcracker of the day. The Amazon uh, little hat, I've probably just wore this last week, right? Because it just goes with so many things. The, uh, the bow jewelries here, the earrings uh, would have been from Belk. Um, I've got... Um, yeah, I don't know if that's Heidi Dawson or not. I forgot whose ring that is. But it's just kind of gold and it's got like some amber crystals in it. And then that pearl ring that I have that's got the rhinestone or it could be diamond chips on the side. I don't know. And this is, I got this from Walmart. I don't even know how many years ago. It's pretty much faded. It's just a sweatshirt. It's got some fancy designs on it and a little red bow. And that's it for the Christmas outfits of the day. The coffee that I got looking forward to having this probably going to have it either midday or maybe afternoon or maybe right before I do vlogmas tomorrow night so it's from the donut shop and it is the red velvet latte so having this with some Dunkin Donuts extra extra creamer I love that creamer and some whipped cream going to hit the spot the lint chocolate of the day and even though I do like these lint chocolates, I think I'd like a little bit more of a variety. So next year I will definitely look for a different one. But it's another one of these little 
mini truffles. They are really, really good. The wine that we're going to have a little bit, and I've already got the save some time. I already took the foil cap off and took the cork out. And I think this was a Pinot Grigio. So we got the holly leaves and the berries for a decoration. I've got my aerator in here from Barbara Jean. So we are good to go with that in a few minutes. But we got the Ipsy, the Glam Bag Plus. So the bag this month, when I first looked at it, I said, is this the February bag? I mean, it's not hearts or anything, but it's just kind of red and pink. So it would have been a nice one for Valentine's Day. Little drawstring here with the gold. You do get one of those little brochures in here, but it's um, not like the one with the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, where maybe you're going to get something, um, you know, the description of what you have in here. But in the Glam Bag Plus, they don't do that. You do have to go online to get that. So it's another, oh, what fun. Let the celebrations begin. We're throwing a month-long holiday party to bring you all the good cheer and glam beauty. So swipe on a bright lip. Slip on your dancing shoes and get ready to revel in the most wonderful time of the year. And then inside, it just, I don't even know what it said. I didn't even look at it. But um, maybe just some of their tips for what they like to do for holiday dressing. Alrighty. So for Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, they pick out two items for you. You get to pick out three. I forgot what I picked out, but I'm pretty sure I did a screenshot and saved it somewhere on my computer. So if I did save that, I will put that in the end so you can see what my choices are. So the first two things that I got, and so, oh yeah, so it cost uh, $28. They did send me an email because I signed up last year and I was able to get it for the $25 and they were offering me extra bonus points the, it was enough to get a free gift from one of their shops and another free gift but when I click on that link it doesn't take me anywhere so I don't know how to get that plus I'm on the auto renew anyway so I don't know what they're going to charge me next year but that's it let's move along Nancy shall we so the first item is from Kate Somerville this is always a good product or at least for me I've had good luck with the Kate Somerville line and it is an exfoliate cleanser, a daily foaming wash. And this has a value of $44. It does come in this tube right here. And you can see, I mean, it's pretty much full. It goes right up to there. So it just kind of allows some expansion, I guess, in the cold. Show the directions and everything. The ingredients are going to be on the back. If they're not there, they're going to be here. Too small to read. But anyway, what it does, and it says it's less not less. Let the, this luxurious foaming face wash help carry away the day's dirt, oil, makeup, and impurities, glycolic and lactic acids, and papaya, pineapple, and pumpkin enzymes help to exfoliate and reveal softer, smoother, and glowing skin. Again, this has a value of $44. I paid $25, so I mean, I got my value right there, right? The next item they picked off me, and I was so surprised because, was it last 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 month? I said, you know, they never send me palettes, or I see other people getting palettes, and it's not even in my choice to get the palettes that they're giving people. Well, you know, one thing that they picked for me was a palette. Who knows if they were listening or if everybody got one. But this is from Illuminati. Designed by Isadel Bedja. This has a value of $48. It does have a mirror inside. So I'm going to try to hold it upside down for you. And these are the colors. So it does have some really pretty colors here. We got some nice sparkles. Uh, yeah, so it's either sparkles or mattes, but there are some, some really pretty colors in here. So it says, um, this is made in collaboration with beauty, wellness, and fashion influencer Isabel Bedoya. This gorgeous palette features an array of colors for endless looks. With creamy mattes, rich glitters, holographic shades, and more, it's your new go-to for day or night in every moment. In between so it is really pretty I kind of got the feeling that even though it's pretty and I'm looking at it saying wow I got a palette more than likely this is gonna sit there and I'm not going to use it so on 
Christmas Eve, I'm going to announce a giveaway. This is going to be one of the items that are in here. So I hope you're watching on Christmas Eve and find out the details of that. I'm still kind of working it out in my head, but I know this is going to be in there. And it is a really pretty palette. And I was so excited to see that they actually picked one for me. Alrighty, so the next item in here is from the Organic Pharmacy. And this is a honey and jasmine mask. This has a value of $74. And this is an item that I picked out. I love using masks, whether I really love the sheet mask because it's so moisturizing. But I do love using other kind of masks and things during the week too. I just really think that's improving my, my skin. I think a lot of it too is, um, you know, even though I've been taking meds for over a year now, um, I still try to drink a lot of water during the day. I think that helps with hydration and keeping your skin plump. But using quality ingredients and masks just to kind of get the impurities out, make sure your pores are clean, is just really important. So I'm glad I finally, Nancy, hashtag, it's about time you got into skincare. So anyway, this one I'm really looking forward to using. Again, this has a value of $74. And it says, don't let your sensitive skin see red. Calm down your complexion with this decadent and deeply nourishing face mask that helps reduce redness, restores elasticity, and hydrates your skin with evening primrose, shea butter, honey, rosehip, and jasmine. You're left with soothed skin and a healthy glow. It says apply a generous layer of a cleansed skin. Leave on for 5 to 10 minutes to allow the active ingredients to penetrate deeply into the skin. Any remaining residue should be removed with, it says, a muslin cloth soaked in warm water. I would probably just use a regular face cloth, I guess. And uh, Or for intense hydration boost, you can leave on a thin layer overnight. And I do like using like overnight mask as well. So this is something I would probably do for that as well. Again, this had a value of $74. Remember, I only paid $25 for this box. Next was another item that I chose. And again, I don't always get the best choices. I don't always know what to do with them. But I just kind of pick something out that it's like the lesser of the evils. So this was Nelson or Nelson J from Beverly Hills. It's called One Minute Hair Botox. It's a leave-in lavender-infused oil treatment. Leave-in condition is so easy to use. It has my name written all over it. So this is something I will definitely use. I always use leave-in conditioners. I used to wash my hair every day, which isn't really good for you. But now on days that I don't wash my hair, sometimes I just kind of rinse it, get my hair wet, put on a leave-in conditioner, stick it up in a bun, and I'm good to go. So anyway, this has a value of $33. It says, give your chemical and color-treated hair the pick-me-up it needs with this potent leave-in treatment. I should probably at least hold it up for you, even if it doesn't want to focus. It says it um, targets your damaged or thinning hair to restore strands to a bouncy, soft, and healthy state in just one minute. Thanks to a blend of sunflower seed and camilla leaf extracts, amino acids, and argan and lavender oils. It says take a dime-sized blob through clean dry hair from roots to end, then brush to blend in the treatment, leave on for one minute, and then style as usual. So that sounds easy enough. Again, this is $33. The last item is again another one I picked up because I mean it's another hair treatment, but what are you going to do, right? So this is called Soleil Miracle Protector. And it is sealed, so I'm going to leave it sealed. Um, this has a value. Hold on to your socks. Hold on to your pantyhose. This has a value of $90. Alrighty, so this says it's a miracle protector spray. Um, it says that bring on, bring on the heat with this strand strengthening, ultra smoothing protective spray. Its nourishing formula also helps moisturize, volume, and shine your hair with hydrolyzed wheat protein and panthenol it says spray generously over your damp hair and style as usual so 90 dollars you know i'm going to give it a try again if i 
did save those screenshots i will post them somewhere at the end so you, that you can see what my choices are so again i paid 25 normally um it's going to be 28 dollars a month for this they say the value i believe it's supposed to be 120 dollars. the value of my box this month was 289 dollars so in this box i got this beautiful palette that's going to be in a giveaway i got the honey and jasmine mask i know i am going to enjoy using that i got this one minute hair botox going to enjoy that i got the soleil the protector spray this was 90 dollars. i also got the kate somerville exfoliating cleanser so that's everything that was in my box i think it's everything i'm going to use other than the palette which is really a really a pretty palette if i was but if, you know i'm getting palettes that i'm not using them all and sometimes i watch them so i'd swatch swatch them so i don't want to give them away so i didn't touch this one i think this will make a really great giveaway going into ending the new year starting new year's so anyway christmas eve watch for that all righty and so anyway i'm getting dry so i think i need some wine so anyway i don't have a wine glass today but i have because i had all this kind of red on i took one of my lolita martini glasses and again she's always got the hand painted items and uh there's always a recipe on the bottom of this so be jeweled so one and a half ounce of whiskey peach schnapps raspberry liquor and cranberry juice and so anyway, that's a glass. We got some jewels on here and some gold painting. And we've got a Pinot Grigio. And again, I got my stopper in here from Barbara Jean. Thank you, Barbara. Alrighty, so let's... I used to really love having like apple martinis and Cosmos. I haven't had one in a while. But if you fill it to the brim, it's, it's kind of hard to walk in these glasses. So anyway... Cheers, everyone. Don't know. This smells citrusy. Citrusy, I'm going to say. Cheers, everyone. Happy Vlogmas 21. I hope I got that right. 21. Mm. So it's got a kind of like a grapefruit type texture. But there's something in here that's sweet as well. But it's a nice crisp wine. I love Pinot Grigio's in the summer, but it's not summer, but I'm going to do my best to enjoy this over the next couple of weeks. Yeah, a couple of weeks. I should be done with my wine in a couple of weeks, do you think? But anyway, I want to thank you guys again for stopping in, spending some time with me. You guys are amazing, and I appreciate you guys so much. So go out, everyone. Take care. Everyone stay safe. Be kind. Be happy, enjoy life, have some fun, and we will see you go guys tomorrow for Vlogmas 22. Love you guys. Bye-bye.